hello and welcome back to my another tutorial in this tutorial i am going to share with you how to insert table in microsoft word so let's take a look how to do that you might be had a microsoft word document you would like to insert table for that this is you can see i had a microsoft word document and i would like to insert table in order to do that you need to click this insert tab and then you're going to find here something say table from here if you click this you're going to see there is a uh, all the table option appear for example if you want to add the table and co uh, column just simply bring it you can you might be need three uh, column or three row or except just simply uh, just uh, bring the cursor over then there's going to be the preview for example i want five column and five uh, row you can see in this word document it's appear five column and five row this is really quite interesting now also you can uh, de design this column and row by uh, here you can see there is a very uh, bunch of uh, pre-loaded design is available you can easily choose any of them let me make a plain table and also one thing more you can make here uh, border style you can uh, make the border style and also you can just draw the border you want for example you want in the underline or if you want to uh, make it a different color you can just make it the different color you want also one thing small you can make here a uh, broader style uh, there is a bunch of broader style available also there is a how you like to add the border for button or all border you can just do with this or if you want to make all this uh, table with one color you can just simply make here and make here all border and that's going to be appear that particular color also you can change the color if you want let me try the other color obviously you have to uh, previously with that uh, made the orange now if you click blue you have to go click one by one or you can go ctrl z z just undo it and then make it as it default and if you decide to change the color just simply uh, do with this also you can uh, replace uh, change the position your table if you are uh, you can going to see this is a, a cursor section if you hold it and bring over the place you want simply you can do it for example you can see i bring it down you can just simply hold it and bring over the place you want to uh, position this table also let me uh, delete this table and let me share it too for example i'm going to delete this uh, let me choose it and delete and then you, you need to click the back space or delete button to delete this and now if you uh, there is a bunch of way to insert table if i go again here insert if i go here table we're going to see something say insert table if you click here insert table you're going to see it can go up here now you might be know in your microsoft for what document you need maybe five column or five row or three column three row you can just simply type it here for example i would like to make here 10 column and i would like to make here five a row and also here is something say auto fit behavior you can make here a uh, fixed column with auto and also one thing small you can make here remember dimension for new table it is might be helpful for you if you want so i've just choose that and then i'm going to click here okay after click over okay you can see i have successfully added 10 column and five a row now you can see this is uh, successfully i had add also there is a another way you can uh, insert uh, a table or column you can make here draw table the place you want uh, draw table that is really uh, very hard things but i'm just not going to uh, share it to in this video maybe later on in other video i will share you to how you can use with the uh, draw table which is really very advanced features let me go here again insert section if i click here table there is also a excel spreadsheet you can uh, add with your excel spreadsheet if you want you can see i had uh, successfully added uh, from excel uh, spreadsheet which is really quite interesting this is maybe some work you need to uh, do with the uh, connect 
collect or connection with your Excel sheet, you can do with this. Also, let me make here control Z. Also, if you go here table section, there is a quick table available. You can easily choose any of them you want. Also, you can see a preloaded uh, or template or table is available for you. You can easily uh, remodify it if you want. For me here, let me make here a v c and let me make here uh, d e f or accept whatever figure you want if you want to customize this table you can uh, do that so this is really quite interesting also one thing's more maybe you had this uh, uh, table and you want to insert more table in this place so for that you just bring your cursor right over here and then you're going to find here in your keyboard tab so if you click here tab that's going to be inside a new table or if you decide to uh, delete the table just select it and click here uh, back button uh, click here the back button and then you're going to see a pop-up appear just make here okay and that's going to be delete let me select it and then let me click here delete but delete will not delete but you have to click the uh, back button for example i would like to delete this uh, column so what you have to do just choose it and then click the uh, back button and then you're going to see a pop-up going to be up here just click here okay so things is if you want to insert more column just bring the cursor at uh, the last uh, row and then click tab and that's going to be automatically uh, create new tab because maybe sometime you had some uh, something to do and in the end, end moment you realize that you need to mo make add more uh, table or uh, more column just simply bring your cursor in the last uh, uh, row or column and then make here tab that's going to be create a new uh, column or row so the, within this way you can easily uh, doing if you had some work in Microsoft Word and you need to do a uh, table modification just simply follow with these tricks. So that's one now. Thanks for watching my video. See you in next one. Peace.